really strong runners in this. The interesting thing is because of the way Reynolds ran yesterday, he's drawn at lane one and he's a very tall man. So it's going to be hard for him to run well from lane one. He would never run a, a world record, I wouldn't imagine, from lane one. It's not ideal. Gee, Black got out well, though uh, it, Harrison was very slow out. The other American, Black already up to him. And Reynolds, I was watching him, he's gone out uh, reasonably hard too with Couture. Now there's a problem with Reynolds. Reynolds might be out of this on the first turn. Forget Reynolds, he's out of the race. Harrison leads Black, Reynolds injured. So there's a sensation. Black, Ishmael and Harrison. And behind those, Clark, no Butch Reynolds. Black and Harrison, the American and the Brit. 50 to go, the first four to qualify. Clark coming home hard. Black draws away. They're running very hard here. And gets through to beat Clark Harrison. Easy roar for Michael Johnson being introduced from lane number five in the second semi-final of the 400. He would have seen Butch Reynolds fail to finish in the previous semi-final and Alvin Harrison run back to fourth place. And the superstar of this American team acknowledges the uh, huge crowd here. Here's Roxford Martin of Jamaica. We saw Clark run a mighty race in the previous semi-final. Just repeating, Black 44.69, Clark 44.87, Ishmael 45.02. She should be okay on that one. Favourites here, Johnson by a long, long way. Probably Barter, that's Martin by the way, there's Barter. Who made the semis four years ago. I think Thomas has got a chance and one of the Jamaicans, McDonald or Martin. Let's see how Johnson sets this up early. Four from the right, the great one. Came out pretty well, very relaxed. Coombs to Silva, Martin, the flashlights everywhere in the stadium. Martin out hard, Johnson sitting on him. Then Barter, Thomas, McDonald, and well back Kamoga. Johnson going brilliantly at 200. Look at him gather them in so effortlessly. Takes Martin. Takes to Silva, takes Coombs. Barter running hard behind him. Michaels look right, he's looked left. He's taking a head count. He's clearly in front. He looks around again, again, and again. Switches off now. They're struggling behind him, world-class runners. He puts on the brakes, slows himself down, and runs faster than black. Can you believe it? It just makes me have a big grin on my face. I have to laugh. I have never seen anybody outclass a field like Michael Johnson can. He'll break the world record tomorrow. Given any sort of luck condition-wise in terms of the weather, if you can watch it about this time tomorrow night, you'll see the world record broken in the 400 metres. And that world record is not too shabby either. 44.59. It's unfair that somebody can run so fast so easily. Martin 44.81, the Jamaicans are in great form. Third, Kamoga, national record for Uganda, 44.85, and fourth, Thomas, 45.01. This was... I think they're going to have to start weighting him up like a horse. What do you think, Bruce? Bring well, him back to the field. He's probably Farlap and Carbine combined, and maybe throw in Tullock. It...